Hi guys, just gonna show you a few more bars now that you're all allowed to enter without your COVID passport and a few that you're not. So let's just go have a look. Starting off, you've got the showboat 20 van just over the road there. You can't enter that without a COVID passport. Just gonna push you in a bit more, try balance my gimbal out a bit. There we are. You can't go in there without COVID passport, sadly, guys. Gonna carry on. Quiet it down now. As for the tropical bar that has been shut a while now hopefully seeing it open sometimes and talk to the devil closed for holidays back open 21st of December then the next spot on my list is Yorkshire Point three. They haven't got any sign up whatsoever. So I won't go as far as saying I'm allowed to enter that, not being double tabbed, but scoot this so I said many of the Yorkshire Pines and Tad's bars do require the COVID passport, so not too sure about that one. You've got Sinatra's premium here and you can enter that without requirement of a COVID passport. Same goes for the... What? In Sinatra's premium? You sure? Oh, so Sinatra's premium? You do require a COVID passport, but the sign's inside, so... No, it's on the door. Oh, okay, it's on the door. It's just a different sign. First friend and the paddock, you can enter them without the COVID passport. The kebab, kebab shop, you need the COVID certificate to enter. But to go to the best kebab shop in Benidorm, it does appear you do not need the COVID passport, guys. So it could come down to a Christmas dinner, Indian style, i.e. a curry. Well, not, guys, it's Benidorm. Of course... The rock and roll house you do need your COVID passport to enter there. Then you got the Euro Clinic. Pretty busy for the COVID tests now. Next door so you have the rock. Another place that requires the COVID passport and the corner bar that shut for refurb. Back soon, hopefully, guys. Think well, they've got the refurb. Ash and his family is away on holiday. So, Ash, if you do see this, hope you're having a good time, mate. Stay safe and enjoy your holiday. 
just coming down past Deer and the old court a Chino now. Deer is of course the supermarket. You get some good deals in there guys as well as the old court a Chino. You can find basically anything in there. Buenas sias, Sonia. So, I do think this new sort of walling with the Covid may affect quite a lot of bars here in Benidorm. May affect Christmas as well. going to be quite a struggle for us not this year trying to find out where we can go for Christmas dinner I mean it might be the case of sending Sue up the supermarket to get a turkey and some veg and just having Christmas dinner at home Idols here, you need a COVID passport to enter, as well as the Red Lion 2 over the road, and of course the Sun Terrace bar over there. You don't need the COVID passport due to the humongous terrace. This Chinese restaurant here. You need a COVID passport to enter the signs, of course, hidden behind the Christmas tree. What did that old geezer say? No, no. Has he passed? Yeah. Sorry about that, guys. Just think someone was just shouting something at me. Sounded a bit like utter. Bleep, but so this place here you need your COVID passport as well so um, yeah there are quite a lot of bars here in Benidorm that require you to have the COVID passport because they have a seating capacity of over 50% yeah, that's what I said, over 50. 50% you said? Mm -hmm. I said over 50%. Yeah, it's just over 50 people. Oh, no, no. So they can take oh. more than 50 people. Yeah, if you can take... If the bar takes more than 50 people, it requires a COVID passport. But to be honest, guys... Some of these bars that do require you to have a COVID passport, not really anyone's checking. Like, I thought bars would maybe get some extra stuff in, have someone on the door as you enter, like checking, but I've seen no way doing it. Me and Scooter Sue were down on front the other day and this one bar, not going to name it, but very popular bar on the fantasy front and we were watching him just let people in, weren't even checking their COVID passports even though they had the poster up in the window saying that you would need the COVID passport. Chinese here you are allowed in there without the COVID passport. Got 
the Union Jack across the road. I think over there at the Union Jack, you'll be alright guys, you will not need a Covid passport. Can't actually see, no, you do not need a Covid passport to go for a drink or a meal at the Union Jack. Nor do you need the COVID passport to go to simply delicious Bunny Dom's answer to Greg's. Now the last place I want to check is a place you've seen us all do a food review on. It's a paradiso. The food in day was gorgeous. So I will be ashamed if you do require a COVID passport to go in there. Here it is guys, the Paradiso restaurant bar and terrazza. Absolute gorgeous restaurant. I will just head on up and see if I can see out. Yeah, you need to have a COVID passport to go in there. Sorry, mate. So that does conclude the end of today's video, guys. Hope you've enjoyed it. Make sure to hit the like button. Subscribe to the channel if you haven't already. And I'll see you in next time, guys. Thanks for watching.